In this video, we will download all the data necessary to complete the course. The source of the data that we will use is called Natural Earth. I've entered naturalearthdata.com into my browser to reach its home page. I'll click this large green button called Get the Data. And we need to download data suitable for a scale of 1 to 10 million from the cultural layers, so I'll click that button. Under Admin Zero Countries, I'm going to click the Download Countries button. And if you're using Internet Explorer like I am, you click the Open button to start downloading the data. After a short time, you will see the data in Windows Explorer where you can click Extract All Files and the location that we want to put this is into C PolyGeo. That folder will get created if it doesn't already exist and you can use a different location if you wish but that's just a place that I'll be describing the data. I can close that one and look for the next data set. I also want to get the states and provinces, so I'll click the download states and provinces button, click open, and once again we can extract all files, we'll extract them into PolyGeo, and we can move on to get the next data set. We'll get the populated places by clicking download populated places button. Open that up. Click extract all files. Place it into C PolyGeo. And move on to the last data set, which is railroads where I'll click the Download Railroads button, open it, we'll extract all files, that's a once again to PolyGeo, and we now have all the data downloaded. To preview the Natural Earth data that we just downloaded in ArcGIS Pro, I'll create a new project using the map.aptx template. I'll call this project Preview, and I'm going to place it into C PolyGeo. I'll leave the checkbox ticked so that it creates a new folder for the project. I'll use the View tab to open the Project pane and then in the Project pane I'll right click on Folders to add a folder connection. This folder connection is going to go to C PolyGeo. So there we can see the shape files that we downloaded from Natural Earth. I'm going to drag and drop each one from the project pane into the map in turn. First the countries, and if we go to the map tab and use the explorer button, we can click on any one of those countries to see information about it. I'll drag and drop in these states and provinces. then the railroads, and I do them before the populated places, because when I drag the populated places on, it hides most of the railroads. Now that we know what our data looks like, I'll close ArcGIS Pro, I'll say no to saving changes, and then I'm going to use Windows Explorer to right click on the preview folder, and delete that folder and project.